CIETNCERT presents Audiobook of Mathematics for Class 6 Chapter 6 Integers Page 125 Part 3 6.3.1 Addition of integers on a number line it is not always easy to add integers using colored buttons. Shall we use number line for additions? Page 126 1. Let us add 3 and 5 on number line. On the number line, we first move 3 steps to the right from 0 reaching 3. Then we move 5 steps to the right of 3 and reach 8. Thus we get... 3 plus 5 is equal to 8. Figure 6.4 2. Let us add minus 3 and minus 5 on the number line. On the number line, we first move 3 steps to the left of 0, reaching minus 3. Then we move 5 steps to the left of minus 3 and reach minus 8. Figure 6.5 Thus, minus 3 plus minus 5 is equal to minus 8. We observe that when we add two positive integers, their sum is a positive integer. When we add two negative integers, their sum is a negative integer. 3. Suppose we wish to find the sum of plus 5 and minus 3 on the number line. First, we move to the right of 0 by 5 steps, reaching 5. Then we move 3 steps to the left of 5, reaching 2. Figure 6.6. .6. Thus, plus 5 plus minus 3 is equal to 2. 4. Similarly, let us find the sum of minus 5 and plus 3 on the number line. First, we move 5 steps to the left of 0, reaching minus 5, and then from this point we move 3 steps to the right. We reach the point minus 2. Thus, minus 5 plus plus 3 is equal to minus 2. Figure 6.7 Page 127 Try these. 1. Find the solution of the following additions using a number line. a. minus 2 plus 6 b. minus 6 plus 2 Make two such questions and solve them using the number line. 2. Find the solution of the following without using number line. a. plus 7 plus minus 11 b. minus 13 plus plus 10 c. minus 7 plus plus 9 d. plus 10 plus minus 5 Make five such questions and solve them. When a positive integer is added to an integer, the resulting integer becomes greater than the given integer. When a negative integer is added to an integer, the resulting integer becomes less than the given integer. Let us add 3 and minus 3. We first move from 0 to plus 3, and then from plus 3 we move 3 points to the left. Where do we reach ultimately? From the figure 6.8, 3 plus minus 3 is equal to 0. Similarly, if we add 2 and minus 2, we obtain the sum as 0. Numbers such as 3 and minus 3, 2 and minus 2, when added to each other, give the sum 0. They are called additive inverse of each other. What is the additive inverse of 6? What is the additive inverse of minus 7? Example 3. Using the number line, write the integer which is a. 4 more than minus 1 b. 5 less than 3 Solution a. We want to know the integer which is 4 more than minus 1. So we start from minus 1 and proceed 4 steps to the right of minus 1 to reach 3 as shown below. Therefore, 4 more than minus 1 is 3. Figure 6.9 Page 128 B. We want to know an integer which is 5 less than 3. So we start from 3 and move to the left by 5 steps 
and obtain minus 2 as shown below. Therefore, 5 less than 3 is minus 2. Figure 6.10 Example 4 Find the sum of minus 9 plus plus 4 plus minus 6 plus plus 3. Solution we can rearrange the numbers so that the positive integers and the negative integers are grouped together. We have minus 9 plus plus 4 plus minus 6 plus plus 3 equal to minus 9 plus minus 6 plus plus 4 plus plus 3 which is equal to minus 15 plus plus 7 equal to minus 8. Example 5. Find the value of 30 plus minus 23 plus minus 63 plus plus 55. Solution. 30 plus plus 55 plus minus 23 plus minus 63 is equal to 85 plus minus 86 is equal to minus 1. Example 6. Find the sum of minus 10, 92, 84 and minus 15. Solution. Minus 10 plus 92 plus 84 plus minus 15 is equal to minus 10 plus minus 15 plus 92 plus 84 equal to minus 25 plus 176 is equal to 151. Exercise 6.2 1. Using the number line, write the integer which is a. 3 more than 5 b. 5 more than minus 5, C, 6 less than 2, D, 3 less than minus 2. 2. Use number line and add the following integers. A, 9 plus minus 6, B, 5 plus minus 11, C, minus 1 plus minus 7, D, minus 5 plus 10, E, minus 1 plus minus 2 plus minus 3, F minus 2 plus 8 plus minus 4. 3. Add without using number line. A. 11 plus minus 7. B. Minus 13 plus plus 18. C. Minus 10 plus plus 19. D. Minus 250 plus plus 150. E. Minus 380 plus minus 270. F. Minus 217 plus minus 100. Page 129. 4. Find the sum of A. 137 and minus 354. B. Minus 52 and plus 52. C. Minus 312. 39 and 192. D. Minus 50, minus 200 and 300. 5. Find the sum. A. Minus 7 plus minus 9 plus 4 plus 16. B. 37 plus minus 2 plus minus 65 plus minus 8. 6.4. Subtraction of integers with the help of a number line. We have added positive integers on a number line. For example, consider 6 plus 2. We start from 6 and go two steps to the right side. We reach at 8. So 6 plus 2 is equal to 8. Figure 6.11. We also saw that to add 6 and minus 2 on a number line, we can start from 6 and then move 2 steps to the left of 6. We reach at 4. So we have 6 plus minus 2 is equal to 4. Figure 6.12. Thus we find that to add a positive integer we move towards the right on a number line and for adding a negative integer we move towards left. We have also seen that while using a number line for whole numbers for subtracting 2 from 6, we would move towards left. Figure 6.13 That is, 6 minus 2 is equal to 4. 
what would we do for 6 minus minus 2? Would we move towards the left on the number line or towards the right? If we move to the left, then we reach 4. Then we have to say 6 minus minus 2 is equal to 4. This is not true because we know 6 minus 2 is equal to 4 and 6 minus 2 is not equal to 6 minus minus 2. Page 130. So we have to move towards the right. Figure 6.14. That is 6 minus minus 2 is equal to 8. This also means that when we subtract a negative integer, we get a greater integer. Consider it in another way. We know that additive inverse of minus 2 is 2. Thus, it appears that adding the additive inverse of minus 2 to 6 is the same as subtracting minus 2 from 6. We write 6 minus minus 2 is equal to 6 plus 2. Let us now find the value of minus 5 minus minus 4 using a number line. We can say that this is the same as minus 5 plus 4 as the additive inverse of minus 4 is 4. We move 4 steps to the right on the number line starting from minus 5. Figure 6.15 We reach at minus 1. That is, minus 5 plus 4 is equal to minus 1. Thus, minus 5 minus minus 4 is equal to minus 1. Example 7. Find the value of minus 8 minus minus 10 using number line. Solution. Minus 8 minus minus 10 is equal to minus 8 plus 10 as additive inverse of minus 10 is 10. On the number line, from minus 8, we will move 10 steps towards right. Figure 6.16. We reach at 2. Thus, minus 8 minus minus 10 is equal to 2. Hence, to subtract an integer from another integer, it is enough to add the additive inverse of the integer that is being subtracted to the other integer. Example 8. Subtract minus 4 from minus 10. Solution. Minus 10 minus minus 4 is equal to minus 10 plus additive inverse of minus 4, which is equal to minus 10 plus 4, which is equal to minus 6. Page 131. Example 9. Subtract plus 3 from minus 3. Solution. Minus 3 minus plus 3 is equal to minus 3 plus additive inverse of plus 3, which is equal to minus 3 plus minus 3, which is equal to minus 6. Exercise 6.3. 1. Find A. 35 minus 20. B. 72 minus 90. C. Minus 15 minus minus 18. D. Minus 20 minus 13. E. 23 minus minus 12. F. Minus 32 minus minus 40. 2. Fill in the blanks with greater than, less than or equal to sign. A. Minus 3 plus minus 6 dash minus 3 minus minus 6. B. Minus 21 minus minus 10 dash minus 31 plus minus 11. C. 45 minus minus 11 dash 57 plus minus 4. D. Minus 25 minus minus 42 dash minus 42 minus minus 25. 3. Fill in the blanks. A. Minus 8 plus dash is equal to 0. B. 13 plus dash is equal to 0. C. 12 plus minus 12 is equal to dash. D. Minus 4 plus dash is equal to minus 12. E. Dash minus 15 is equal to minus 10.
4. Find a minus 7 minus 8 minus minus 25. b minus 13 plus 32 minus 8 minus 1. c minus 7 plus minus 8 plus minus 90. d 50 minus minus 40 minus minus 2. What have we discussed? 1. We have seen that there are times when we need to use numbers with a negative sign. This is when we want to go below 0 on the number line. These are called negative numbers. Some examples of their use can be in temperature scale, water level in lake or river, level of oil in tank, etc. They are also used to denote debit account or outstanding dues. Page 132. 2. The collection of numbers minus 4, minus 3, minus 2, minus 1, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, and so on is called integers. So, minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 4, and so on called negative numbers are negative integers and 1, 2, 3, 4 and so on called positive numbers are the positive integers. 3. We have also seen how one more than given number gives a successor and one less than given number gives predecessor. 4. We observe that a. When we have the same sign add and put the same sign. 1. When two positive integers are added, we get a positive integer. For example, plus 3 plus plus 2 is equal to plus 5. 2. When two negative integers are added, we get a negative integer. For example, minus 2 plus minus 1 is equal to minus 3. b. When one positive and one negative integers are added, we subtract them as whole numbers by considering the numbers without their sign and then put the sign of the bigger number with the subtraction obtained. The bigger integer is decided by ignoring the signs of the integers. For example, plus 4 plus minus 3 is equal to plus 1 and minus 4 plus plus 3 is equal to minus 1. c. The subtraction of an integer is the same as the addition of its additive inverse. 5. We have shown how addition and subtraction of integers can also be shown on a number line. You were just listening to the audiobook Mathematics for Class 6 Narrator Gaurav Marva Assistance in Production Soumya Malik Producer Vimlesh Chaudhary Presented by CIET NCERT New Delhi, India